Nurmeha, a Rohingya Muslim woman, who crossed over from Myanmar into Bangladesh, along with her daughter Rashida, grieves for her three daughters after their boat capsized near Sharpuria DWIP, Bangladesh Monday, October 16, 2017. An overcrowded boat carrying Rohingya Muslims fleeing Myanmar capsized Monday in the Bay of Bengal near a Bangladeshi fishing village, killing 12 people, including six children, police said. Da Yasan App Photo No Meha, a Rohingya Muslim woman, who crossed over from Myanmar into Bangladesh, along with her daughter Rashida, grieves for her three daughters after their boat capsized near Sharpuria DWIP, Bangladesh Monday, October 16, 2017. An overcrowded boat carrying Rohingya Muslims fleeing Myanmar capsized Monday in the Bay of Bengal near a Bangladeshi fishing village, killing 12 people, including six children, police said. Da Yasan App Photo October 16, 2017 1005 AM Dhaka, Bangladesh An overcrowded boat carrying Rohingya Muslims fleeing Myanmar capsized Monday in the Bay of Bengal near a Bangladeshi fishing village, killing 12 people, including six children, police said. Survivors of the capsizing told local officials that up to 65 people were on board and almost half of them were children, local police official Sheikh Ashraf Azaman said. The capsizing occurred as the boat was approaching Sharpuria DWIP in Technofincox's Bazaar district, bordering Myanmar's Rakhine state. He said villagers told police they recovered five bodies and at least 21 people survived. Including Monday's capsizing, boat accidents have killed at least 184 Rohingya trying to reach Bangladesh. Hundreds of thousands of Rohingya have fled Myanmar since August 25, when the military launched a crackdown decried by the United Nations as ethnic cleansing. Myanmar's military has said it launched clearance operations in response to terrorist attacks, but the UN and others have said Myanmar's response was disproportionate. The refugees have described widespread and indiscriminate violence and arsons. Bangladeshi Prime Minister Sheikh Hasina says that her government will continue to support the Rohingya, but that Myanmar must take them back.